What's good, world? Um, I just got news of this rapper from Dallas. Um, he went by the name of Little Loaded. And there has been reports that he's passed away. So I looked into this and I seen that from a friend of his, the friend stated he took his life because his girlfriend cheated on him. And there was other people that knew him that said he really was into this girl. And he had stated to a friend that he would kill anybody if they ever slept with her. And he said that, you know, he really liked her and he said great things about her. And just based off of these things that I read and I've heard, it seems like he was very, very emotionally invested into this woman, you know, and what happens a lot of times when we fall for a person, we tend to put all of our emotions on them, meaning they control our emotions. You know, if we're not with them, we're unhappy. If they do us wrong, we allow it to just mess up our day or to, you know, it, it just alters our mind. And I feel like he he's such a young dude. He was only 20 years old. And I just feel like he was just very wrapped up into this young lady. And um, he, he could have maybe been going through other things in his life. And this thing could have just been the last straw for him that pushed him to the edge. But I want to make this video just to say that, please, people, please find happiness in here before trying to love somebody. Because, because what can happen is that you could be sad in here and you meet somebody and they become the reason you're happy. Now they are in control of your emotions. And this could have happened to this young man. This is just me speaking from experience. Because I, I was 20 years old at one time. And I'm not saying this, this happened with him, but there's a likely chance this could have happened. You know, he could have been unhappy, met her and just was really happy once he met her. Now she's the reason he's happy and he puts so much into her and then she lets him down and he becomes super depressed and um, then he takes his life. I've seen this happen numerous times and um, he was such a young man. I, I don't really know much about his music, but something about this story kind of uh, touched me because I've seen people go through these things where they would take their lives because of a person cheating on them or doing them wrong. And those type of people love hard. And unfortunately, people will do them wrong still, even though they know the person really loves them, they'll still do them wrong. You know, you really can't control people. People are going to do what they want to do regardless and that's just what it is. That's just what it is. There's people who've been dating people for 20 plus years and find out the person been cheating on them the whole time. And they probably would have never thought that person would do that. But people are unpredictable. You can't put nothing past anybody. And my prayers go out to him and his family and his friends. And because it's sad, 20 years old. And from what I read, he was very talented. He was a very talented young man. And I will go check out some of his music, you know, just to check him out. But uh, yeah, people, please find happiness in here before trying to love somebody. Because once again, if you love somebody before you find happiness in here, that person is now in control of your emotions and what whatever they do will affect you. It will affect you in a major way. That's why I always preach to people, please keep God first, love yourself, and then try to love somebody. Because if you're going through things and you and your happiness relies on this person, 
that that's that person's only a person. Their 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 flesh, flesh is weak. These people will disappoint you. They will mess up, and and sometimes people. They put people on such a high pedestal, and then when the person lets them down, their whole world comes crashing down. And this guy is young. He's 20 years old. You know, he was still developing mentally, you know, figuring things out. And, you know, he was just probably in a bad state of mind. And when he found out this young lady did it, this probably just drove him to the edge. Because we don't, I don't really know what this man was going through. I don't know. But all I know is, Learning that his homie said it was because of the girl, that that's 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 heartbreaking, man. Twenty years old, you know, and and, and to that young lady, you just gotta really be careful. You gotta really be careful at how you treat people, because not everybody's strong enough to take pain. Not everybody's strong enough to take this stuff. Some people, they can't. They've been through so much, they just can't take certain stuff. And you, you you, can't take people for granted. You can't treat people any kind of way because you just never know what they're going through, man. But, you know, RIP low loaded. And uh, it's sad. But uh, it's your boy Ron, I'm out.